Hey, what's up everybody? Thanks for clicking on the video. This is David Pendleton and I am excited to bring you this video today. Have a question for you. Are you interested in playing a mobile golf game that will reward you the player for your time and efforts? If so, I have something brand new and exciting for you to try out. Now this is coming to us from NeoWiz. They are the developers of Golf Impact, which is a game I already know and love playing. NeoWiz is going to bring us a new version of that game, which is going to be labeled Crypto Golf Impact. Now, this is a new generation of play to earn. I encourage you to download the game and give it a shot. You might be asking, what does play to earn mean? Well, play to earn games are mobile online games that allow you, the player, to earn real world value by completing objectives within the game. These rewards that you will earn come in the form of an in-game asset such as crypto tokens. Crypto Golf Impact is powered by the Neopin blockchain and players can tee off in real time with players all across the world to earn crystals which can be swapped with the native in-game token. What's really cool and unique about this is they are the first one to have a play to earn mobile golf game. So let me explain to you how I will help you get comfortable with Crypto Golf Impact. This video today is going to be video number one of four videos that I will make to introduce you to the game. Okay. Today's video is going to be very basic. It's going to cover how to download the game. Once you download the game, what's going to happen? And I'm going to explain to you the home layout screen and then play a couple games. Over the next few weeks, I will be providing you with three additional videos that will outline and cover some of the more complex parts of a play to earn game. Now, when it comes to crypto golf impact, you're going to need a Neopin wallet. So in my second video, I'm going to explain to you what a Neopin wallet is and how to create yours and get it up and running. From there, I will explain the crypto pass and the sponsor contract. Then lastly, I will cover the ways to earn and exchange crystals in the game. If you ever need a refresher, I have created a playlist section on my YouTube channel labeled Crypto Golf Impact Instructions. This will make it very easy for you to find one of these four videos in case you need to go back and listen to a couple things, right? Now, you can also subscribe to my channel and turn on the notifications so you get alerted as I make new content. But hey, I'm pumped up. I'm ready to go. Without further ado, let me introduce you to Crypto Golf Impact. So the first thing that you want to do is just head over to your App Store or your Google Play Store and just search for it, Crypto Golf Impact. It'll come up right away. I went ahead and took the liberty of downloading the game before starting this video so you didn't have to wait for it to download and go through all that good stuff. Now, this will be brand new, as you can see. This game is loading up for me for the very first time. So we're going to be walking through as if you were a brand new player to the game. Now, the first thing that's going to happen whenever you download the game, you have to agree to the terms and conditions. First, just like you would with let's any other try game. a practice hole. And now it's going to have us try a practice hole. But for the sake of time in the video, I'm going to skip that because I'm going to be showing you some one on one play anyways. And then I also want to turn off the sounds here so it doesn't override my microphone. Now, the very first opponent you're going to play is going to be a bot. It goes by the name of James. Okay, this is not a real player. Great shot. This is just a bot that the game has created to get you comfortable with basically the mechanics of the game. Nice on. Your turn. Take shot. 
perfect shot. All right, so as you can see here, we tee off. We're gonna get ourselves really close. To nice the hole in on. Opponent's turn. Now they'll end up missing their putt. For Eagle. Eagle. Win. Hey, after that, congrats. You are undefeated so far on your Crypto Golf Impact career. So now we've eliminated that sound. So the first thing you do is you open up your bag that you get by beating your opponent. I'm going to cover this home layout section so that you get familiar with what each one of these icons is and how to navigate through the game. The first thing that we're going to do here is start in the very top left hand corner where you see this blue profile image with three trophies earned. This is where you can really edit your player profile. So if I were to hit this pencil right here, I can change my name that the game gives you right and then I can just try something different like maybe we'll try Pendleton gaming and there we go so now I've created my name I could if I wanted to uh, connect this thing like secure it uh, through Facebook and have my image load up there that would be on my Facebook account but this is also where you're going to see your overall career stats in the game. So you can see here we played one game. We won that game. So our win percentage is 100%. And of course, we're on a one game win streak. So right here, pretty elementary. This breaks down, you know, your overall player stats. From there to the right of that section is going to be your gold. So we have 600 gold coins available. And those gold coins are going to be used to get yourself into playing one-on-one -on -one tour games against people from all across the world. To the right of that, you're going to have your gems. Your gems are a very valuable asset in the game, and I'll show you what those do here in just a moment. And then, of course, next to that, you have your settings. Now, I've turned off the sound effects just to make sure this video comes through nice and clear for you all. But you can see here that you have different things that you can, um, you can you know, toggle back and forth. Sound effects, the graphics, you can put your voice. Do you want to talk with a male or a female talking to you out there? Uh, you have your language, tutorials, customer support. You can read all that stuff. Again, very easy to figure out. One really cool section about Golf Impact is going to be the community section. If you were to click that icon, you can actually see other player shots. So again, these are uh, real players from all across the world. And you can see some of the recent shots that were made. Now... From there, you're going to have your impact pass, which is this big yellowish orange icon right here in the top center where it says receive reward. You're going to want to make sure you spend a lot of time uh, checking this because this is where you're going to receive some really cool free features of the game. Uh, also a section where you can buy additional features to unlock things a little bit faster and build your profile up a little bit better as well. So you can see here, you're gonna have three sections, starting from the left-hand side. You have the free pass, then you can activate impact pass one and activate impact pass two. But right now we're just gonna cover the free part of the game. So we just earned ourselves our first free 10 gems, okay? Now you can see here um, at the top where it says zero of five, this little bar, those are gonna be how many points you need until you get your next bag open or your next free reward. You're going to earn those points by opening bags 
and doing some other parts of the game as well, which we'll see here in a little bit. Now, you could also speed up your progress in the game by purchasing and activating the impact passes. To do that, you just hit the activate button above these icons, and that will bring you up to a menu to where you can uh, download, or what I should say, purchase uh, the impact passes. You can see there, it would be really beneficial because you could earn yourself a gold bag right off the bat and 75 gems, which are super valuable as well. But you can go down through here and see that there's going to be several different bags and gems that you can collect along the way. It's really fun, it's really engaging, and it's really important that you check here because you can get your free you know, bonuses along the way. And then secondly, if you do get yourself through all 37 challenges and bag openings, you can then be rewarded with extra gems in the game. Really cool, really good section. I like it a lot. Now to the right of that, you're going to have your overall ranking. So you can see here, this is going to be your weekly league ranking. You can move up the list by winning games. Every time you win a game, you're going to gain gold coins. And you can see your gold coins rankings here. If we were to go all the way to the top so far, the number one player in this bracket this week has earned almost 40,000 gold coins. Now, depending on how often you play and how many games you win, you can get promoted. When you get promoted, you'll be available to play uh, more features of the game, such as tournament play, etc. All right. So below there, we have the trophy section. The trophy section is also very cool and to make sure that you go ahead and check this because the more trophies that you earn in the game, the more free rewards that the game is going to give you. So right now we have three trophies won. Once we get to five total trophies, we're going to get two feather balls for free. Once we get to 10 trophies, you can see we're going to get two New York balls for free. Now, this is really where I want to give NeoWiz a big shout out as a game developer. That New York ball is a premium ball. In other games, that would cost you real money to get it, and that would be the only way to get it. Well, on here, if you check your trophy section, you can earn premium balls along the way just by playing the game and having good trophy success. I think that's really cool. I think they deserve credit for giving some of their premium stuff away to their players. Now we're going to highlight the free bag here. We're going to open up the free bag and I'm going to explain a couple things to you if you're brand new to the game. When you open this bag, you're going to get gold coins. So you see we got 100 more. We went from 600 to 700. We unlocked the new club, the dart club. We unlocked or no, we added more club cards to our drone. So right now we're at a level one. We have four of 10 cards collected. Once we get to 10 cards, our drone would then go to a level two and it would be better accuracy and things of those nature, right? We have another seahorse card and we have a feather ball. Now you also see there three point icons come up on the board. So now we have three of our five points here at the top filled up. Once we get two more points, we'll be on section number, uh, section number one of the progress meter and we're going to get our blue bag. So you can see there just by opening that free bag, we got three points and we only need two more points to get to the next bag. All right. From there, we're going to jump down to the bottom section. We're going to skip over the play section and we're going to go all the way to the bottom right hand corner, which is going to be this badge icon with the star located in it. All right. So that's going to be a coming soon section. I'm not going to give any spoilers out there what's coming soon to the game, but it will be a lot of fun and it will be very engaging. Okay. So the left hand side of that is going to be your golf bag. Now you're going to want to make sure, especially as a new player, as you earn new clubs and you unlock new clubs, you want to go ahead and put those in here because they're going to be a lot better than your starting clubs. So if you take a look here at the wedge section, remember we unlocked the dart club. So now we can put the dart club in the bag and you can compare the clubs. Um, so you can see here side by side, the beginner wedge compared to the dart. The dart allows you to start using top spin. It allows you to start using curl, which means you can either make your ball go left or right off the tee box. 
and you even get a little bit of a ball guide. And you're also gonna see something there called impact, which I'll explain what impact means as well. So we're gonna select the dart club and put that in our bag. We also unlocked the seahorse short iron, so we'll select that and put it in our bag. We have not yet unlocked a new long iron, so stay tuned as you open your bags to make sure if you unlock a long iron that you put it in your golf bag. We did get the driver. Remember, we did unlock the jet ski, so we will select that. And I think we had a wood club as well. We did. We have the drone. Now, one of the most common questions when you're brand new to these types of games, you're like, okay, what are the best clubs to go after? Well, in this game, they're going to be your legendary clubs. And you can see the legendary clubs by, um, like right here, take a look at the tornado. That's a legendary club. You can see how the icon, the graphic of the club, uh, it does things. It's shiny. Uh, it stands out. That's the legendary wedge. Each type of club has one legendary. So, for example, if I were to go here to the driver, the legendary club is going to be called the meteor. You can see that right there in the second row. It's a meteor uh, driver, and you have the wood burning on the club. So you can see how you can see it in the graphic. Now, the legendary clubs, those are as good as they get, okay? They're awesome. Now we're going to go back to the middle section. So the flag with the circle, you know, on it, that's your home screen, okay? Then we're going to click the diamond section. Now, the diamond section is something that you need to check every day. Why is the diamond section important? Because if we scroll to the top, you're going to see a couple different things. One, that's where you're going to find your crypto pass and sponsor contract, which, again, that's going to come in a separate video. Right now, we're just learning the main layouts of the game. This is where you can earn or buy some gems, as you can see here. Also, where you can get the impact pass benefits. But if you scroll down here to this section, this game gives you one free bag every 24 hours. So we're going to go ahead and open up our free bag right now. In this section right here, you can also use your gems to purchase new club cards or upgrade current existing club cards. So we have 10 gems. If I wanted to get the polar bear, it would cost me 225 gems to unlock that club. Okay. Now you'll see other things here such as tickets and different bags you can buy. So if we wanted to get ourselves a gold tour one bag, we could buy that right now for 110 gems. You can also win those by playing one-on-one -on -one games as well too. And these are also where you'll find how to buy uh, other balls in the games. Now these balls right here, you can also buy with gems. So if you're interested in picking up a couple clover balls, you could click on the ball, you could see the stats of the ball, and then you could see that you could get 60 clover balls for 300 gems. And then of course, if you wanted to, you could speed up your play and buy gems with real money and also gold with real money as well. All right, back to the home screen, and we're going to go to the very last section here, which is going to be our, the bottom left-hand corner. But before that, you notice because we opened up that free golf bag, we just earned three more points. Now, remember, we needed two points to get to the section one blue bag, and now we just did that. So now we'll open this bag. So we got a few more gold coins. We are going to be able to upgrade our drone club. So we'll show you how to do that as well. That's great timing to get that on the first video. And you can see we just earned three more points by opening that bag. So the next time we open a bag, we're going to be eligible to pick up those five gems right there for free. Let's head over to our golf bag. Since we do have a club to upgrade, you can see here the wood club, the drone. If we click that for 300 gold coins, we can now upgrade that club. And it lets you know what you're going to get. So we're going to increase our power by one. We're going to increase our top spin by four. And we're going to increase our ball guideline by 4%. So if I hit the 300 gold coins, you're going to see here, it's going to go ahead and do its magic. It's going to upgrade us. Now we have six cards earned out of 20. So 14 more cards, we will be able to put that to a level three. All right. Perfect. 
Now, one thing to note here is once you start to play the game and you get to tour number two, you can unlock the training section of the of the game. Now, the training section is really unique. It's going to allow you to train your clubs. You don't have to do anything except select which club you want to train. And then after a certain time has passed, that club will be trained, okay? And that's going to slow down the needle speed of the club. So at the very beginning of the game, some of the clubs are hard to hit perfect, especially the putter. You can train your putter, and the more that you train it, uh, the easier it will become to hit perfect. That's not available to us yet, but it will be after we complete tour number two. Now, again, the last section that I wanted to cover here is the bottom left-hand corner. This is going to be your new section. This is going to show you some of your crypto pass and your sponsor contract. Again, I'm not going to go over that yet in this video, but I just wanted to show you basically the main layouts of the screen. Now, what's really cool is if you download this game in July, in your inbox here, you're going to be given the crypto pass for free. Okay. You can see here we have it for 30 days. Again, I encourage you to download and try the game out immediately because the crypto pass is going to be free right now. But hey, that's the main layout of the game. Let's go ahead and hop into a one-on-one -on -one play. Now, this game has beautiful courses. Right here, we start off at the Maldives. It's going to cost us 100 gold coins to play. Now, I will say if you're looking for tips and tricks on the game, I have played a lot of Golf Impact. The mechanics of this game are going to be the exact same. So if you want to check out some of the videos that I have on my channel, they're all in a golf impact folder. You can find them very easy where I give you tips and tricks on how to compete in the game. But hey, now we're up against real world players. This is going to be game number one. Our opponent is going first. Remember, you want to hit that perfect ball. Our opponent hit a good left here. But they're going to be on the fairway, no problem. Now this will take us to our turn. You can see here this is a turn-by-turn -turn base game. We have a little bit of top spin on our jet ski club. So we used a little bit of overpower there. I didn't go crazy with it. You know, the most important thing that we can try to do is hit a perfect ball, which we did. Now, at the very beginning stages of your game, especially if you play games like this before, you know your ball guideline is not going to be the greatest. It's going to be a lot of guesswork. I would encourage you to win as many games as possible and, you know, use those coins and those club cards to upgrade your clubs to get yourself a good ball guideline and a leg up on the competition. You see here our opponent's going with a little bit of overpower as well. We do have headwind on the hole, which means our ball is not going to travel as far as we think it is because the wind is pushing back at us. And they're going to be on the green for a putt. Now, the thing about golf impact is putting, like I kind of mentioned earlier, it's not the easiest thing to do. It is a little bit more difficult to hit perfect when you putt. So for me, you know, my strategy when I play the game is to upgrade my putter uh, before any other clubs. Putter is something that we typically use on every hole. But I think it's important to have a club there where we can hit perfect. You do see I hit perfect here with my wedge club. And we're going to get it. Uh, oh, we just leave it right there at the hole. So as I was alluding to earlier, I upgrade my putter and I upgrade my driver. Um, that's what I put you know, as my first priority because those are the clubs that we're using all the time. So now our opponent has to putt. Be careful on the power. This looks a little strong here, but they did not hit perfect, so they're going to miss. There isn't a whole lot of leeway when it comes to a non-perfect putt in this game. I really enjoy that aspect because it does make it a little bit more difficult, um, you know, to get the ball into the hole. But here we'll have no problem being this close to the pin. Even with the great ball, we're going to easily make it, again, just because... We were so close to it. So we're going to win the game. We're going to be a perfect two for two so far in our crypto impact career. And we pick up a blue bag. You can try to rematch if you want to. But for me, I'm going to go back to the lobby. 
So you can see there, I've moved up the weekly leaderboard a little bit. We're gonna get our gold coins. We're going to select the blue bag. We're gonna unlock it. So in four hours, we'll be able to come and open up that bag and get those rewards. If you're impatient, you can speed it up by spinning gems. But now look how the trophy section turned gold. We're gonna go there and remember, we're gonna pick up these rewards for free. So now we've just earned ourselves two free feather balls. Hey everybody, I know this first video was a little bit lengthy, but I just wanted to introduce the game to you, uh, let you understand the home screen layout and overall the basics of the game. If you feel there's something that I missed, please let me know in the comments section below. You know, one thing I do pride myself on with my channel is I'm very interactive with everybody who watches. I try to respond to 100% of the comments that come through. Um, so please, if you need any help, if you have any questions, if you feel there's something that I missed, please leave me a comment and I will get back to you. Other than that, I encourage you to download and try Crypto Golf Impact. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, this is going to be really my first play to earn crypto game that I'm getting myself involved in. And I just can't wait to get in the weeds of this game with you. Uh, other than that, please subscribe, please hit the thumbs up, and I hope you just have a wonderful day. Thanks, everybody.